Just let that shot be water off a duck's back. Henny, what's the player facing here? He's got, mm, I'd say, a solid 145 here. Going with the six iron here. Oh, I didn't see this as possible. What a shot. That wasn't their best approach, Beamer. Now from that lie, missing the green was always an option. Oh, wouldn't that have been nice? Playing their fourth shot. Four shots behind our leader. Oh, I thought that one was going in. Let's try and make this one. He only dropped the one shot. He's currently sitting in third. And moving down the leaderboard as well. Teeing off now at the 11th hole. Par 5, 558 yards long. Avoid the fairway bunkers on the left-hand side. And you might have a hope of going forward in two. However, you better be brave and you better know what you're doing because this green will call you out on the second shots if you're not careful. This looks to be heading for the cut stuff. Sitting at two under par in third position. This one's right of the green. Well, they've found the bunker, but a chance to maybe save from there. What a shot! Almost went in the bucket. This would be a momentum saver here, getting this up and down. Ooh, that almost went down. Mm -mm. Straight out of the top draw. Just eyeballing that one, trying to make it. A good stroke. So no change on the leaderboard for this player after that hole. Now teeing off on the 12th hole. Par 4 12th, a new design in the last couple of years. Water all the way down the left-hand side, but it's a drivable par 4. Most players will bail out to the right, but the brave ones will take on the green with their tee shots. Twos and threes are easy to come by, but so are fives and sixes if you get it out of position. Yep, that'll work, that's fine. Just missed the hole. Oh, well played. Scorecard filled with threes never hurts. Good putt to make this. Ooh. Just a tiny putt is all that remains. A live look at the leaderboard and Bubba Watson finds himself in top spot. Let's see what happens here on the 13th hole, shall we? So many different levels to this green on the par three, playing 181 yards from the back. You can get it close. You can even make a hole in one. But watch out if you hit in the wrong spot on the green. It'll be difficult to two putt from there. Opting for the six iron. This needs just a little work to the left hand side. Ah, uh, that's disappointing. 
This would be a great up and down from this spot. How close was that to going down? Just six feet between here and the hole. This is important. Big par putt here. Good putt, that. It's currently tied for third. This hole's a tough two-shotter. A long par four. If you hit it down the left-hand side, the golf ball will chase a long way, but you'll be blocked out by some trees. You hit it out to the right, you're going to be on top of a mound, but you'll have a really good idea of what's in front of you. This hole historically plays as one of the toughest ones on the back nine, and it's all because of where that green sits. It sits from right to left with a decent amount of movement in it. It is not straightforward at all. This hole causes players all kinds of problems. Going with the eight iron here. Clubbing up, smart. Got to control it though. Let's see. Anything in five feet to be handy from here. That wasn't your best effort, was it? And from the green side rough here. Didn't that look good for a long time? And this next putt, it's for bogey. Bubba Watson is two shots ahead of the field. Here we find ourselves on the tee of a par four. One of the more simple tee shots on the golf course, par four, 470 yards. Just a little fade required off the tee to the fairway. The green sits up above the fairway a little bit, surrounded by a couple of bunkers, but I gotta say, I like this hole. It's straightforward, it's simple, before you head into the final three. This one from about 160 yards out. Currently four shots off the pace. This one's left of the green. That was a little bit of a misfire, I'd say. And here we are with the third shot. Four strokes off the lead. Ooh, wouldn't that have been nice? Time now for the fourth shot. Four shots behind our leader. Ooh, a nine-foot chance here. And that's a couple of bogeys on the bounce, I'm afraid. Two bogeys in a row, never a good sign. Now playing a little defensively. As we head now to the par five next. Ideally, players want to take their tee shots from right to left, start off that fairway bunker and move it left back in the fairway. Anything down the left-hand side can get caught up into those trees and really cause players issues with their layup. You find the fairway, now you have a massive decision to make. Go for it or bail out to the left, thinking that's the safe play. It really is not. You have to be brave and try and find this green with your second shot. If not, it could come up and bite you. And this putt to move into a tie for third. Yes, Luke, and only two holes to go in this event. Didn't quite have the right stuff there. Putting for birdie. And that's their fourth booty of the day. 
And that will take him to one under. Our current leader is up by three shots. Let's see what happens here at the 17th. Par 3, 17th, 137 yards, Island Green. I've actually seen a caddy throw it onto this green, but with a golf club in your hand, can you hit the green? Going with the pitching wedge here. You're going to put your foot down. This is as good a time as any. What's in front of them, Henny, with this putt? Setting up this putt 20 feet from the cup. Short game has been especially sharp today, Luke. Very impressive. Just didn't drop. That's disappointing. Right on four feet. Should make this one. He's got this for his part. Never mind. Just go and make the next one you stand over. And big bad Bubba Watson currently leads the field. It's time to tee off on the 18th hole. Par four, 462 yards, and you're going to find out what kind of player you are when you tee off here. How brave are you? How much do you trust your swing? If you find the fairway, that's a great start. But the second shot awaits. Opting for the nine iron. Yeah, this one is uh, veering off a little bit to the right. Oh, I've gone unlucky there. Now, a little off the mark on that approach shot. Hard to control the distance when you're coming out of the rough. Wow, that almost went in the hole. And this putt for a final score of 72. Oh, so close. This putt's about four feet from the hole. Oh, just missed. This putt is for double bogey. And that brings to close today's round. Well, I'd hate to use a tired old beaten up cliche, but wow, I've made a career off it for the last 20 years. This player came, they saw, and they conquered. What a rivalry win. Luke, you were my hero, so now I'm a little lost. I might follow this player as my hero and see how they do things moving forward, because that was a truly phenomenal performance. On behalf of myself, Rich Beam, and all the hardworking folks at 2K Sports, Thanks for tuning in and see you next time.